I put my hand up. You know, I step forward on many occasions and say things perhaps which other MPs won't say. And occasionally, yes, I say things the wrong way. Because of Twitter, a storm then comes about about it and I have to deal with it. I'll be very clear, the last couple of days have probably been the most miserable as a member of parliament. I got it wrong, Piers. I don't know how many times you'd like me to say that. But I stand by the fact that Afghanistan is in a very bad place. Well, the economy will crash. Can I suggest, something? Can I suggest we have something? some difficult questions. OK, can I suggest something? Will you delete the video? I'm happy to do so, sir. I'm absolutely happy to do so. Will you do, do that so. immediately this interview is over? Because that would indicate I'm you genuinely to... are remorseful. I, of course I am. And I will not further to that. I'll put then put out a clarification, clarification of a statement to do so. But All there right. is a, an underlying message uh, that we've not spoken about Afghanistan. I don't know when you last brought it up on your programme. It has been abandoned. The DFID budget for the United Nations... Yeah, you do, so. You don't have to... Right. Tobias, with respect, you haven't got to lecture me about Afghanistan. My brother was a serving British Army colonel who served tools in Afghanistan, so uh, I'm very aware of Afghanistan. I've covered it uh, a lot over the last years. I was extremely critical of the way we withdrew uh, with the Americans from Afghanistan. It was a total debacle. Uh, but I also happen to think the Taliban are a bunch of ruthless wolves who have taken the and poor, I don't the poor women... And any of that. ..the poor women of Afghanistan back to the Dark Ages. And I think, unfortunately, you got used in some way which provoked you to do that video, which just looked like it was promoting the Taliban, which I think was a catastrophic error of judgment. And I've known you a long time, and I'd rather be straight with you and tell you that. I think if, the best thing you could do is to finish this interview and delete that video and then explain why...